that you have the greatest of all backings but that you know the great and mighty one is doing some terrible things in righteousness would you raise your voice can you scream can you shout can you shout can you shout the Lord is with you and nothing will go wrong raise your voice shout 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 help me look at your neighbor say neighbor I get back in leave that neighbor meet another one tell them I get back in I know they walk alone I get back in I know they walk alone help me find ten persons scream in their ear I get back in I know they walk alone I get back in I know they walk alone you better prophesy it declare it the world will see the world will know I know they walk alone no arrows no manipulation I know they walk alone not in July not in August not in September not in October I know they walk alone I know they walk alone the heavens are open I know they walk alone high favor at work in my life angels all over I know they walk alone I know they walk alone if I were you I will raise my voice I will shout I will shout I will celebrate I know they walk alone if God be for us if God be for us who 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 can be against us raise your voice give the Lord a shout you're gonna do something very stupid now what I'm about to ask you doesn't make sense but somebody declare say I will do it now say after me, declare after me, say right now. Say we call on Jerry Eze for his many testimonies. Say Jerry, over to you. Testify. Now open your mouth, testify. Just testify. Just testify. 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 As many as be the things. Don't let anybody distract you. Testify. 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 If you run out of English, testify in tongues. Testify. If I were you, I will not stop. I will not stop. Testify. 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 Ay, 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 ay. Testify for your mother. Testify for your father. Testify your Dakota. Araba. Isakato. Hey, 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 hey. He can't have a Dakota. And let me call for it. Call for it. The things which be not as though they were. Call it for it. Call it for it with your testimony. Call it for it. Rabada. Asaka. You will remember today. You will remember today the same way you testified. Somebody testify. 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 Asaka. Asaba. Hey. 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 Atakata. Alabada. Ashabea. The beginning of the end. He says you should testify. He says you should testify. Ranaba. Ashabada. Ekoto. He will not return back for it. He will not come back for it. He will not come back for it. Ajabada. Ataka. Eleja. Eshada. Ajaba. Araka. Asadia. Ashaka. Ataba. Araba. Ataka. Eleja. Ara. Ashada. Ekoa. Asadia. Ata. Ashada. Ah. 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 If you know, if you know, if you know, it's already happening. If you know, if you know, it's already happening. Raise your voice, raise your voice. Give the Lord, give the Lord a shout, a shout, a jumper, a jumper. Somebody.
somebody shout her, 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 give the Lord a shout. It has happened. Even your amen is not sure. I say it has happened. What you have testified about, you will not cry about them again. What you have testified about, angels have been released to make it your reality. Receive it right now. We silence every opposer. We come against contending powers. We come against holding patterns. Let them be broken. Let them be broken. Let them be broken. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Right now. Somebody turn that and the Lord made me laugh. If you believe it, let your amen turn the louder. Let your amen rise higher. I wish you could scream it again. And the Lord made me laugh. If you believe it, can you turn that in louder? Amen. Glory to God. Somebody turn that glory. Even you're not sure, somebody declare it, say glory. Let me hear your thunder and say glory. Would you open your scriptures to the book of Psalms chapter 2? The book of Psalms chapter 2. Hallelujah. We're in the book of Psalms chapter 2. From verse 1. we we'll read from verse 1 all the way down to verse 9. Glory to God. Somebody shout and the Lord made me laugh. Say it again, and the Lord made me laugh. Say it again like a minute, say, and the Lord made me laugh. If you believe it, can you turn that louder? Amen. We read the book of Psalms, chapter 2, from verse 1 to 9. It is a custom of this house for us to stand for the reading of God's word. And we're going to read from verse 1 all the way down to verse 9. Shadi Bali and the Sunday. You see, the Spirit of God wants me to pray for your child cancer of the bone marrow by the power that raised Jesus from the dead I announce let it be reversed right now I say let it be reversed right now let it be reversed right now I don't know the stent they put in your heart I don't know what that is for I don't know they put an implant in your heart the devil is a liar it, it is not a pacemaker it's not a pacemaker I don't know what it is but the Lord by the power of the Holy Ghost anything that led to that condition let it be reversed right now the Lord is showing mercy to your family you to your father's house everything that happens happens late people get married late people start businesses late but the power that raised Jesus from the dead I announce let it be broken right now let it be broken right now let it be broken right now. Jean de Bayana. Everybody lift up your two hands. This prayer might just be for you. Please don't be distracted. Seasons and opportunities you lost. Without even knowing your lost things. At the sound of your amen, let it be restored unto you. Lift up your two hands. Say, my father, my father. This prayer might be for you. Say, my father, my father. Deliver me from wicked and unreasonable men if you believe a thunder a louder amen say this prayer again say my father my father from july to december deliver me from wicked and unreasonable men if you believe a thunder a louder amen can you scream a better amen can you shout a louder amen glory to god we read the book of Psalms, chapter 2, from verse 1 to 9. I don't know, the Lord is putting on me to pray this prayer of a scripture I used in one of the services. Lift up your two hands. When Moses' face began to shine, they put a veil over his face. He allowed it so that they can cover the face. When you begin to shine, from the new season there's a new season God even if you are the one that wants to cover it 
or your mindset or your failures or your weaknesses will want to cover this at the sound of your amen no power will veil your glory I say no power will fail your glory. 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 I decree it is done. I don't know why your gums are producing a lot of pus. By the power that raised Jesus from the dead, let it be reversed. Let it be reversed. There used to be great happenings there, but everywhere is now empty and deserted. The Lord said, I saw it. In this second half, I will restore all that you lost. I decree it is done. Lift up your two hands. This might not be for everyone, but it might be for you. Say, My father, my father. Say, give me my own. Say, my father. Say, I sense there is an anointing in this service for everyone to carry their own. Say, my father, my own, not another person's own, my own. I receive it now. If you believe it, thunder it louder. Amen. Thunder it louder, amen. Thunder it louder, amen. Thunder it louder, amen. Everyone lift up your two hands. Any item in your house that was given to you to be a point of contact for a demonic activity by the power that raised Jesus from the dead, I announce, let it be broken right now. person I'm talking about the person that gave it to you will come back for it and they will tell you that they have been under torment and the Lord said it will not pass the next seven days whatever they wish for you let it return back to where it's coming from let it return back to where it is coming from let it return back to where it's coming from if you will not keep your testimony, let there be a short walk over your life. I announce it is done. Open your scriptures to the book of Psalms chapter 2 from verse 1 to 9. Glory to God. At the count of three, we're going to read together. One, two, three. Why do the hidden rage and the people imagine the vain thing? The kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers they cancel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands together and cast away their cords from us. He that seated in the heaven shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Yet shall he speak unto them in his work and vex them in his sore displeasure. Yet have I set my king upon my holy hill of Zion. I will declare the decree the Lord has said unto me. Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. Ask of me and I shall give thee the heathen for thine inheritance. And the uttermost part of the earth for thy possession. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Thou shalt dash them in pieces like our potter's vessel our father Bashaya. we ask that you have your way let there be none of any man but all of you father have your way father in the name of jesus lift up your right hand and declare i love the word of god say it is working for my good powerful in my mouth and active in my destiny say the entrance of the war bring a light and brings understanding to the simple say Lord do your work in my life let your amen turn down please before you take yourself find some people who have as much positive and miraculous and supernatural energy like you are give them a high ten and tell them congratulations five of them five of them 
tell them congratulations, 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 congratulations. Glory to God, glory to God, glory to God, glory to God. What our God cannot do. Please take your seat in the presence of the Lord. It was in one of those services that had said that we have several times the Bible will categorize the laughter. I mean, I mean, the fools laughed in the scriptures. Uh, there was what I call the soulish laughter. There was the laughter of God. There was the laughter that God gave Sarah. There was a substance. And in this service, uh, and uh, uh, please, I don't even know what to call it, but why and how God laughs. Why does God laugh? People of God, look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor, why are you not laughing? Tell your neighbor, even God laughs. No, I'm not asking you to laugh. I'm just reminding you that some of you, I think it is part of your identity. I don't laugh anyhow. People of God, God even laughs you. People of God, shorten, don't shorten your lifespan with lack of laughter. Do you understand what I'm saying? Laugh. Did you hear what I just said? Laugh. When they expect you to cry, Laugh. Find joy in simple things of life. Laugh. When you make mistakes, laugh. If you speak wrong English, laugh. As you are walking on the road and the heel of your shoe goes off, laugh. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. If you want to say one thing and another thing enters your mouth, laugh. People of God, if you laugh at yourself, nobody will laugh at you. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. So that thing you are planning to laugh, me, I have laughed a laugh. So in case you are still laughing, both of us will join and start laughing. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. You can imagine how beautiful life would be if you were laughing a long time ago. Don't take everything personal. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Don't take everything personal. You know, pastor, as I was passing, I realized that they were saying I'm not yet married. Laugh. If I'm not married, I will not marry myself. And I'm laughing because any man that has not seen me is their loss. I don't, I don't know whether you understand it. Laugh. I don't know whether you are getting what I'm saying. Laugh. And they go like, ah, her legs are, her legs are not even straight. Laugh. Laugh. You can't have straight leg and have care leg at the same time. So, God has given you your own and he has given me my own. The problem is not the key leg, it's how I will rock the leg. Do you understand what I'm saying? Laugh! Did you hear what I just said? Look at your neighbor and tell your neighbor, laugh. Sometimes, so, sometimes when you stay on computer, you press, 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 press. If it is not working, close it and laugh. I cannot come and kill myself. It's interesting, people of God, that we move from there to this. Meanwhile, let me remind you, the Bible says, a merry heart doeth good like medicine. You see, in this second half, don't let anybody, they never reach. Don't let anybody take your joy away from you. Don't let anybody take your laughter away from you. Did you hear what I just said? I'm a man on a mission. You are a woman on a mission. You now come and remove the laughter from my lips. No, let me tell you. Don't tell anybody this now, I'm telling you. If they pain them, still you, they laugh. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. See, I'm not telling you to do that one that people do for wickedness. You know, you, you walk into your office, <laughs> no, that's, that's not the one I'm talking about. I'm talking about the one that the joy of the Lord is your strength. That even if the fig tree does not blossom, I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Somebody turned down, the Lord made me laugh. Okay, back to the subject matter. Why and how God laughs. The Bible says, it starts with the question, why do the hidden rage and the people imagine vain thing? The kings of the earth said themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed. Say, now watch this. Let us break their bands asunder. And cast away their court from us. Now, look at this. He that seated in the heavens shall laugh. And hold them 
in derision. Have them in derision. Now, excuse me, who were the people that were laughing, sir? Who were the people that were um, uh, conspiring? What's that? Huh? Why? The people that were raging, the hidden, Abia? All of them, both the kings and all of them, come under them. Say, why do the hidden rage? Why do the hidden rage? Why do the hidden rage? Now, wait a minute. It seems like God knew something we did not know that was making him laugh. Now, the psalmist by inspiration now told us something. The Lord was saying, He said, Ask of me. Ask of me. I shall give thee the hidden for thine inheritance. The reason why they are raging is you've not asked me to make the ragers your inheritance. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Why they are keeping their shoulders like this is because you have not asked them. So the Lord is looking at it and laughing. Say, look at Look at, look, look at, you are scared of this person that is raging. You don't know that this rage is your inheritance. You don't know that these people that are doing like this have given them into your hands. You don't know you have dominion over this person. Somebody shall fire. So in other words, the reason why God laughs is when he looks at dominion. God knows that these people are supposed to be under these people. Why are they making noise? I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Cancer is meant to be under you. Why is he making noise? The evil arrows are meant to be under you. Ask of me. That was the inspiration of the psalmist. But right now, we're going to declare to it. If you rage, I keep you where you belong. Did you hear what I just said? If you rage, I keep you. This is what should. When you know. When negativity rages, I know where you belong. You will laugh. You will laugh. The doctors bring you a report. You will laugh. You don't have shish in your pocket. You will laugh. People walk away from your life. You will laugh. Because I know where you belong. Did you hear what I just said? Tell your neighbor, say neighbor. The more they rage, the more you need to keep them where they belong tell your neighbor i know where they belong tell your neighbor under your feet tell your neighbor match them tell your neighbor crush them if you believe it let me hear your loud amen people of god you see that negativity under your feet the lord said why do the hidden rage that's how the scripture began and then again we find the psalm he said ask of me Ask of me, I will give you this thing that is raging as an inheritance. Ask of me, I will keep this thing that is raging where it belongs. Ask of me, you are letting it rage and you are upset. Look at me, I'm laughing. He that seated in heaven is laughing because these things are meant to be under. But the reason why the one that sits on earth will not laugh is because he thinks that the rage means that they are in charge. Have you watched any of these WrestleMania things? When they come to the ring, hi! I'll kill you. I'll maim you. People of God. And they will say all of those things. And some of them have body that is big like this. And then you just go like, man, this guy, if he touches this other smaller boy, he will just mess him up people of God by the time I don't know how many of you let me particularly say how many of you watched that epic fight between Hulk Hogan and Undertaker that year that year that year did you, did, did you, did you watch it that epic fight people of God that was the, 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 the season where you know when Undertaker used to come, come and sometimes they carry him in a coffin do you, do you remember do you remember exactly so when you see all the serere around Undertaker, you just tell yourself, man, man, Hokogan is in trouble. And then when he comes, as soon as they enter the ring, there's a way he used to do his hand like this. And then we just see, bah, Hokogan will fall. Bah, Hokogan will fall. That is story five. Go and check it. 
Just did bad. We call them kept falling, kept falling, kept falling. Me, I didn't like the man because he was black and had coughing all over. So by all means, I wanted him out of the way. Next thing, I don't forget that fight. He had hit, he had hit, he had done everything. Hokogan Karechia. I don't know what happened. Now I hit him on the head, but the referee was not looking. When he not knocked it, I said, good. Anything you can do. Anything you can do. Let this man go on. Because it's in the kingdom we belong to. If you find fire, collect. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Anything you can hold, just carry it. Just hit and hit and make sure you keep them where they belong. If I spoke about you, let me hear the word fire. Say today, whatsoever that is raging around my life, say right now, I cross you. Go down, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. Shafaya, 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 Shafaya. Take your seat. The heathen that is raging, ask of me. Cancer that is raging, ask of me. Why God was laughing is because he knew these things are meant to be inheritance. Lack of marital bliss, ask of me. That's the way I laugh because they, you've, not, you've not done anything. But I said, the psalmist by inspiration say, As us, he told us, I have given you power. It is there. I don't need to ask of him for the power he's already given me. All I need to do is to, if you rage, uh -huh. don't make, when, when you see a rage, you panic. When you see a rage, you say, God, what is this? What is it? What it is is that you need to keep it where it belongs. And where it belongs is under your feet. Somebody say, eh. Say, is that why God laughs? Look at your neighbor, say, this is how God laughs. When he realizes that what is raging is under your feet. If you understand the thunder, a louder amen. amen. Please do not forget the second thing I'm saying right now. The Bible says, why do they hear the rage and the people imagine vain things? Against the Lord and against his anointed. The Bible says the king of earth set themselves together and take counsel against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, Let us break their bands asunder and cast away their cords from us. Now, watch this. He that seated in the heavens shall laugh. People of God, he that seated where? Yeah. He that seated where? Yeah. People of God, let me tell you the truth. If you are sitting on this earth, it is difficult to laugh. If your awareness is that you are sitting on earth, it's difficult to laugh. But when we know that we are seated with Christ in the heavenly places, far above principalities and powers, my life is hidden Christ. I'm in Christ in God. All I do is to do what? Laugh. Look at where I am. Look at where you are. There is no meeting point. That is why I laugh. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. Even though I am in the world, I am not of the world. What you are seeing here is not the real me. The real me is seated somewhere. The real me is watching the me that is here. Oh yes. Do you understand what I'm saying? The real me is a spirit. I'm going to microphone, I'm it's not me that is here. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. It is my body you are looking at. But before I became a body, I was first a spirit. Because he said to Jeremiah, before I formed thee, I knew thee. And I ordained thee a prophet to the nations. Am I, am I, am I communicating? That is why I laugh. A human being say, I will deal with you. Do you deal with spirits? People tell you, well, well, you see this thing, um, um, I watch it, uh, and maybe in another five years or another ten years, uh, and it, it, will not be, it will not be like this again. Hey, 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 hey. 
it was never recorded that you are the author and finisher. Have you not heard there's a generation that will break patterns? You will check and look out for them in the next five years. They are still here. Except they lose direction with God. As far as their eyes are on God. As far as they are listening to God. People of God. As I am like a green olive tree. Planted in the house of God. I trust in his mercy. Somebody shall say I laugh. Say I know where I am. No, you, I'm not sure you know where you are. Somebody shall say, I laugh. Say, I know where I am. You need to tell diabetes, this is where I'm sitting. Tell that the Ayama no Koshabara. How and why God laughs? Because of where he's seated. Now, people of God, you need to learn how to laugh like that. Because of where you are. He has given me everything that pertains to life and godliness. So what has not manifested is either dependent on a revelation I have not assessed or the man that God wants me to mature into. But whether I have it, I have it. And this is the reason why I'm constantly studying the word. I'm in the place of prayer, receiving revelations so that I can become who he wants me to be. Whether I have it, I have it. All I need him to point to me is where it is. That is called revelation. Did you hear what I just said right now? There are too many things that God has already given it to you. Every day you are in the prayer altar. Every day you are connecting and studying the word. It's already there. So one of the things that God does for you is not just to give, is to give you revelation to know where what he has given you is. And people of God, why do the hidden rage and the people imagine vain things? The Bible says the kings of the earth set themselves and the rulers take counsel together against the Lord and against his anointed, saying, let us break their bands asunder and cast away their courts from us. Uh -huh. He that seated in heaven shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. Uh -huh. Then shall he speak unto them in his wrath and vex them in his sore displeasure. I'll come back to this one later on. People of God, laugh at the devil, laugh at his skin, but don't forget to deal with him. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. It is called stand fast in the liberty. You know when people tell you, oh, Jesus has done everything. He's finished it. It's done. Before, is it not done? It was done since. But the Bible says, stand fast in the liberty wherein Christ has set you free. In fact, the reason why I am addressing the negativity is because I know it is already done. Remember, the Lord will laugh, but the Lord will not end up in laughter. So when I see situation, I say, this is nothing. It, don't, it, would, it wouldn't stop at this is nothing. No? Don't come and say this is nothing and you walk away. When you say this is nothing, now open your mouth. And now speak to that nothing. Am, 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 am I communicating? Speak to it and say, get, get out of here. Get, get out of here. Get out of here. Do you know whose house you entered? Do you know whose son you touched? Do you know whose career you are messing with? Am I communicating? That was not where I was going to. Please show me the next verse. The devil is an idiot. Show me the next verse. The Bible says, I will declare the decree. The Lord has said unto me, Thou art my son. This day have I begotten. Now what am I going to declare? I'm going to declare the decree. What the Lord said unto me. Am I communicating? In other words, the psalmist gives us a greater insight into why that scripture has laughter in it. He said, I will declare decree. The Lord has said unto me, thou art my son. That means when I see the hidden begin to reach, I will remind myself of who I am. At that point, you start laughing. When you remind yourself of who I am. I'm the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. 
my life is hid in Christ and Christ in God. He maketh his angel spirit and his ministers flames of fire, which means I am a moving fire. Thou hast anointed my head with oil, my cup run it. He will make my tongue like the pen of a ready writer. Quota. I am a sharp threshing instrument in the hands of the Lord. That has the, wheresoever the sole of my feet shall tread upon, I will have for a possession. Ask of me about a shande and I will make bright clouds in the heaven. Madoko and Paul, oh my goodness, man, both the former rain, the latter rain. You must remind yourself of who you are. People of God, there are too many people wanting to change situations, and in the middle of it, they forget who they are. Let me say this to you. Pay attention. Whenever you are confronted with any challenge, before you speak to the challenge, remind yourself of who you are. Did you hear what I just said? And Zachariah questioned Gabriel. Gabriel said, I am Gabriel. I stand in the presence of God. Can't, let me remind you again who I am. Am I communicating? People of God, they had already beaten Paul, blue and black. Sent him to prison. When he came out, he now said, I am a Roman. I am a Roman. And fear came upon everyone that they had touched a Roman citizen. But Paul, why did you say you are a Roman after the beating? Am I, am I communicating? They finish beating you. You are now saying, I am a Roman. People of God, that is how some of us behave. The devil will slap you. Bah. Bah. By the fourth slap, that's when you remember who you are. Sir, before they slap you, Meshagaba. Let me say this to you. You don't need a challenge to remind yourself who you are. Every morning, which is something all the females do here, Every morning, as you stand in front of your makeup table or your makeup, I am the righteousness of God in Christ Jesus. My life is hid in Christ and Christ in God. I am the apple of his eyes. Just try this thing I'm, I'm saying. You, you're going to find out in your, I, you know what I'm saying. You enter into the shower and you are showering and, and you are not reminding yourself, ha ha, ma toba daya, and the benusha, the Lord goes before me like a mighty and terrible one. Mekota balaba shadia, erende biadabala. Angels are already moving ahead of me. Sir, you don't need a challenge to remind yourself of who you are. People of God, let me tell you something. If you don't remind yourself of who you are, you will fall for who you are not. And people of God, please show me the next verse. Show me the next verse. The Bible says, Ask of me and I shall give thee the hidden for thy inheritance and the uttermost part of the earth for thy possession. Now this is this. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron and shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Now I want you to know why God laughs. Let me ask you a very simple question, church. Let me ask you a simple question, church. When a potter, right, breaks a vessel and dashes it into pieces, what's the idea? Huh? To do what? Someone say, throw it away. Throw what away? Potter, potter does not throw anything away. Because all of them are made of clay. Yes. So, thou shalt break them with a rod of iron. Remember when they come, when the challenges come. Number one, you shall break them with a rod of iron. Dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Why did the scripture feel a need to tell you like a potter's vessel? That means the same things that came against you. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. 
you can turn those things and mold it into a vessel that will be useful for you. That is why God laughs. You send me rejection, it will turn. For I know that this will turn to you for a testimony through prayers and the supply of the Spirit. You will break them like a potter's vessel. They put a ring and they walked away. It's okay. It's okay. God is going to use your walking away to bring me someone I will forever be grateful to that I am. I don't know whether you're getting what I'm saying. People of God, the only way from God to take you out of some comfort zone is to make some people hate you. Am I talking to someone? The only way for God to make you an exceptional star is to make those you call friends to speak against you. The only way for God to give you help that he will take glory for is to make the helpers not help you. Am I talking to someone? Because God wants to use that situation and mold it into you know the only reason why God allowed you to fail after you mounted no, nothing I cannot fail I can't, is because God wants to let you know it's not by your strength so that you can start learning how to lean on the strength of the Lord this is why God laughs thou shalt break them with a rod of iron thou shalt dash them in pieces like a pot let me tell you the truth whether you have faith or not listen Every pain you went through, tears you shed, I said they cannot be wasted in second half. One of the prayers we went back to 2015, we went back. Anything that did not work for you, any conspiracy, anything that made you break down, anything that made you ask God, where are you? Anything that made you ask God, God, am I alone? At the sound of your amen, all of it will turn together for your good. I say all of it will work for your good. 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 And people of God, I want you to understand that the Bible says, Thou shalt dash them in pieces like a potter's vessel. Yes, yeah, show me the next verse. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings, be instructed, ye judges of the earth. Sir, let me say this to you as I tidy up. It is important that you understand. Let me do a bit of chronicling. What is raging? has been given to you for inheritance. Keep it where it truly belongs. Remember that what you are going to dash in pieces is already designed by God to be a vessel that will come out of every situation that did not work well. Have it in mind that whatever the devil throws at me, God is going to use it to do something amazing out of it. Am I talking to someone? Remember where you are seated is important. There's a way when we sit. There's a way we look at things. Am I communicating? When you know where you are sitting, there are things that do not move you. So, remember where I am seated, I have everything. I'm only assessing it by revelation and maturity. Did you hear what I just said right now? Every believer has already been given everything that pertains to life and godliness. But he's constantly getting into that fullness by revelation and maturity. Did, I, did, did you understand me right now? So people of God, the difference between you and another person is what that, a revelation the person has that you don't have. And most times you can have a revelation but you are not mature for it. For as long as the heir remaineth a child, he differeth not from the slave. He probably might know his heir, so revelation is not a problem. But for as long as he has not yet mature, 
he's still a soul. We get into the fullness of what God has ordained for us, either by revelation or maturity. Did I make sense? When you see the way God laughs, that will let you know. Remember, God laughs when he knows the situation does not make sense. But at the same time, he releases warfare against it. Don't just say it's not. Have your warfare kit intact. Can I say it again? Have your warfare kit intact. That is how we laugh. Am I, do I mean, they sit down at the board meeting, take decisions, and you're there speaking English with them. And they are, they are talking, we're sorry we can't give you the, um, this thing, we're sorry we're going to put you out of the job, we're sorry. We're, you just go like, no, no, but I think I'm qualified. I, I think it's okay. I think you, you know, and then they finish speaking English and all that. Carry your fire. Leave. We are going to meet in a junction. All of you that are in this board meeting, they are busy speaking English for me. <laughs> and then they are looking, they expect you. To be disappointed in the meeting because of all that happened. I go like, oh, Mr. 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 Uh, whatever. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. You don't know this, thank you. I'm telling you. Have you no, no? When a man of the spirit is thanking you, Made Shadad, Baba Zalo Korodasi, Shepede Adabala. I'ma wake up in the night. I'ma put all the files on the ground. I'm going to mention your name one after the other. The earth is the lots and the fullness thereof. The people and the Yako party. For the hearts of the kings are in the hands of the Lord. Like rivers of flowing waters. He turned them whithersoever he will it. Who says a thing and a comment to pass. When the Lord has not commanded it. That's the way we roll. We are psychedelic in the morning. But we are warriors in the night. We wear all the good clothes. We can wear all our Chanel and all our Louboutins. And, and have all the makeups at the right places. And then we sit down and we smile at you. Oh, Mrs. Jones, you have the cutest of all smiles. You look very good. You are very smart. Not be here where you end. When we finish this English, Abada, am I even waiting for that as you are entering your car? La -ka 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 -sha! And they are still asking you why you are shouting. They never see shout. Rise on your feet wherever you are. Would you lift up your two hands and speak in the Holy Ghost? Just speak in the Holy Ghost. Baro de Balikasha. And the Yanababa Baba Suka Telaba. Rekoto Bali de Barababa. Rekasuba de Ketelebe. Rasha de Bea. Rekoto Balababa. Rasa Badi Katola. Rakete Betele. Rasha Badada. Rako Badi Zalaba. Reko Bolo Tola Barisi. Isha Kata. El Lebeana. Sakota, Randa Balababa, Rakoto Balazi, Eshebend, Ekotode, Isakala, Arabada, Raketebet, Eshadabala, Rakoto Balada, in the name of Jesus. I announce it is done. You will laugh. You will laugh again and again. In Jesus' name we pray. Somebody help me shout glory. glory. Let me hear you scream glory. glory. People of God, would you get your communion ready? We pray over every liquid you have. It ceases to be ordinary. It becomes the very blood of Jesus. Pray over every substance you have. It ceases to be ordinary. It becomes the flesh of Jesus. I decree what the enemy meant for evil is turning for your laughter. Say, my father, my father, whatsoever 
that shouldn't be in my life. Take it away. Say, my father, whatsoever that needs to be in my life, let there be a release of it into my life right now. Let your amen turn down. Eat of the flesh of Jesus. And drink of the blood of the new covenant. Amen and amen. 